Mini War Gaming's Beat the Cooler Bat Rap! Hey there, Mini War Gamers. Owen here from Mini War Gaming with Dan. Can't even see your mouth moving anymore. But anyway, uh, this time we're coming back with another 40k Bat Rap, and we've got 2,000 points of Tyranids against Orcs. So stay tuned for that, and we're going to show you those armies. And remember, you can click down below to get your own Tyranids and Orcs. Uh, any <coughs> Happy War Gaming. Go for it, Dan. Call them out. This is Orcs! <laughs> Bad by Gaskell Thraka. Cause why not? And we're going for as mo most inefficient use of points possible here. We got two weird boys, although they are not upgraded to warheads. And so scrap what I just last said. They're just normal weird boys. I have to take the first thing I roll. We got two killer cans. I thought I'd finally bring up these are painted by Blue Table Painting. And it's the army on loan. You can go and buy do do bluetablepainting.com. Also, three mega knobs from Zare. Ten knobs, eight knobs, eight. It's only eight. I can count. Um, they're, you know, pain boys, cyber bodies, all the uh, shenanigans. Two boom guns, blue wagons, just for kicks, because they're funny. And two squads of boys. These are just ten, ten boys, ten shooter boys, no upgrades at all. So <laughs> the word goes against everything I stand for with boys, but I needed more troop choices. <laughs> and so there they are. And then we have six stack of jets. And that is the only hope this army has. <laughs> Weird boy wog and docket jets. Yes. So these are the Tyranids that I brought. Yep, there's lots. We've got two flying hive tyrants with twin link devourers on each one. Or two twin link devourers on each one. Six warriors with bone swords and sighting talons. Six more warriors with bone swords and sighting talons. Two Trigon Primes, the Carnifex, and the Doom. That's it. No spawning. Nothing special. We're just going to we're gonna outmaneuver him with our two flyers. <laughs> Night fighting. fighting. Oh, you bet it is. Probably. He's like 800 <laughs> I'm getting messages. Phone or army deployed. Look at that lineup of warriors. I'm gonna rush. I want. I wish I'd made them shrikes and they had wings. That would be scary. A little. Do they, do they have no guns? The warriors? Guns are for chumps. <laughs> the only guns in my army are on these two. So here we are with Dan's turn one orcs. Starting off with him rolling to not press that. He moves up with his killy cans then. Just trying to get a bit closer. And then he moves up his knobs who are probably the only thing in his army other than the mega knobs that are actually really threatening to my army. But then again, he knows that. That's why he's got just bare minimum units. And then his weird boy moves up with the one unit of boys. And then Gazgul and his two mega knobs, three mega knobs, three mega knobs. Yeah, that's right. They move up. Then the other weird boy and his orc boys move up because we both know it's going to come down to close combat. So shooting phase begins. He fires one of his battle cannons off. It hits the middle guy. Totally blows that Tyranid away. The only thing there was a bit of a cover save because there's guys in the way. But he dies. Now he fires a second shot. This one scatters just a little bit and happens to just barely hit one of them which it of course wounds and he fails his cover save and dies as well he starts firing rockets from his killer cans which miss thankfully and then he fires a second one which does hit but i do get a cover save but it doesn't matter it's still a five up and i didn't make it the weird boys now checking for psychic powers that one fails but he doesn't perils and this one over here he does pass and he deep strikes, I believe, and chooses to deep strike right where he is. And scatters a little bit, but totally fine, didn't land on any of his own guys. And that's pretty much it for Orcs turn one. A couple of spray shots, killed a few Tyranids, but that was expected, right? Tyranids turn one begins, and first things first, we roll for, I forgot to show you my psychic powers. This one has Endurance, the Hive Tyrant here, which he did get. And the other one has... Uh, the one where they get it will not die, feel no pain, and eternal warrior is what the other one has. And I cannot recall what the name of that psychic ability is. Probably come back for that. Anyway, the warriors move up, advancing just in a straight line. These ones, of course, don't have to do a test because being near the hive tyrant, they are fearless. I think they're actually synapse in themselves. But anyway, the hive tyrant fires away shooting its twin link devourers at the first tank there going for fives and sixes no fours fives and sixes and it easily gets blown up and wounds a couple of the boys nearby and it actually kills one i think 
Yep. And, oh no, this is the Mega Knobs, my mistake, so it only does one wound to him. And now the other Hive Tyrant shoots, hitting me for the Killican. Once again, fives and sixes, and Twin Link to hit, so it easily gets destroyed as well. And we roll to what kind of objective it is in the middle, and it's just a normal objective. So stay tuned for part two and see how this bat rep goes. <laughs>